नमस्ते एवरी वन टूडे वी आर एट नमस्ते वेब थ्री डेली नमस्ते वेब थ्री इज आर वे ऑफ वेलकमिंग वेब थ्री टू इंडिया इट्स अ ग्रेट कम्युनिटी कोलेबोरेशन इनिशिएटिव बाय कॉइन डी सी एक्स वेर वी हैव दीज ऑन ग्राउंड इवेंट्स इन डिफरेंट स्टेट्स ऑफ इंडिया टूडे इन द कैपिटल सिटी वी आर डिस्कसिंग विद वन ट्रिलियन डॉलर इकोनॉमिक पोटेंशियल इज वेब थ्री द नेक्स्ट बिग थिंग ऑफ इंडिया द इवनिंग इज फुल ऑफ ग्रेट कॉन्वर्सेशन अमंग पॉलिसी मेकर गवर्नमेंट ऑफिशियल्स इनोवेटर्स एंड बिल्डर्स डिस्कसिंग द फ्यूचर ऑफ वेब थ्री इन इंडिया so let's check it out so what is one advice that you would give young startups that are booming in the web3 space in india so i think the biggest thing that all startups and individuals that are in the web3 ecosystem in india is to look at building trust and building products and services that can be used to solve real world problems across different layers of india whether it's at the national level the state level corporate level individual level and also create an ecosystem india lost out in being a leader in comics in a being a leader in entertainment we should not lose out in the digital equivalent of that space what would be your one message to the young entrepreneurs or say builders um, basically the excel, excellent talent pool that we have in india which is in the space of web3 building in the space of web3 from india for the world any advice for them very simple believe in yourself and if you can sell uh, across india with its diversity with its huge expectation and huge negotiating power you can sell to everybody uh any comment on according to you the future of web3 in india i think we are the emerging uh, global hub we have a very vibrant startup ecosystem we are the third largest so given that innovation and that india is the largest digital hub and the talent pool that is getting churned out i think we are going to really apply web 3.0 and all its associated emerging technologies to really new use cases if you could to our audience uh, and a lot of them are young people uh, very passionate about the space but they don't know exactly what is web 3 so if i were to give you one line explain web 3 to us in one line so web3 is about in one line read write and own so the consumers the community people who use applications of internet will also start owning these applications owning a share of these applications so that is i think what how to define web3 in one line yeah. uh so we are at the namaste web3 delhi chapter uh, how's the vibe in delhi and how is it different from any other place that you Yeah that's a very very interesting question and in Bangalore I was expecting a lot of developers a lot of founders entrepreneurs and it was the case but in Delhi I was expecting a lot of policy people and lot of uh, uh, you know non technology people but when I was interacting with a lot of people there are a lot of builders there are so many people uh, who are innovating and building in this space what that tells me that is that building in web3 is not limited to Bangalore It's spreading in uh, Delhi or even every corner of the country as well and uh, uh, that's actually true So I was quite excited to see that, and the vibe here is amazing. Uh, so much energy, so much uh, vibrancy in this uh, ground here today. Very excited to see that. What an evening! I think it was great being a part of such insightful conversation. And one thing is pretty clear: India has an excellent talent pool building on Web three from India for the world. which will definitely have a huge economic growth potential to be a part of these meetups in other cities follow us on our social handles and know when is namaste web3 happening in your city till then goodbye by transferring crypto to octo wallet you confirm understanding its risk we make no warranties or representations about third party material on octo or value utility or legal status of crypto there is no legal recourse for any loss from such transaction